What's up, guys? This video is for Daniel Larson. Daniel, first off, man, I want to say that I am terribly sorry that you're home this way. I am terribly, terribly sorry that you're home this But, I heard your story, I heard about what's going on. And I'm reaching out to tell you right now, dude, that these people that you're entrusting, these people that you're trusting, they are not your friends. These people that you're trusting are the same ones that harassed me, they extorted me, they blackmailed me, they made me do things to myself that were nasty, and they have assaulted me. They have done me like they're doing me. They follow my family around. They follow me around. They do all kinds of stuff to make my life a living hell. And Daniel, I'm telling you right now, you need to get away from these guys. These guys are very dangerous people. These people that are telling out to you that, that, you know, that you think they're your friends, they're not. These people that you're entrusting, are the same ones that tried to kill me a few months ago. And I do mean kill me, I mean, they tried to shoot at me through my bedroom window and kill me. They attempted murder on my life. These people are evil, you know, these people will manipulate you, they will make you think that they're your friend, they will make you think that, you know, you're the king of the world. But really, all they're trying to do is extort you, exploit you, and use you for money. Because that's what these people care about. That's all they care about is money. They don't give a fuck who they hurt. They don't care who they hurt. They don't care who gets killed, who doesn't get killed. They don't do a shit. They don't care about that. They care about one thing and one thing only, and that's money. And power. And control. That's all they care about. Money, power, control. So I'm telling you right now, Damien, as someone that's going through this same thing, I'm telling you this right now, man, from a legal standpoint, you need to go to the police. You need to get a lawyer. You need to make them see that you're being harassed. What I would do, if I were you, and this, I'm going to be doing the same thing soon. What I would do if I was you, man, I would literally go in, if you're able to, I would go in and file a report on these different people. File a report, and if you can, try to get a protection order against these people. That's literally the best thing you can do. As soon as I go to court here on the 30th, I'm doing the same thing. I'm getting a court order against these people. I'm doing the same thing. But Daniel, I'm telling you right now, man. Marty, William Floyd Hall, and all these people that you think are your friends, they're not. These people are evil, disgusting, wild solution. And the guys that I'm working with right now, known as the Shadow Collective and Sneaky Jim, these people are helping me to shut these people down so that people like you don't get hurt. You're a good dude. I can see that. You're a good person. And I don't want to see you end up in the same situation that I end up. My situation is super, super bad, man. It's super bad. One of them two in my house stepped on our property and then leave. And I protected my home from this person and I ended up being arrested. And now I've got a charge for civil assault. And it's messed up. It's fucked up. These people are going to do you like they did me. They're going to use you up until they're done with you. And then if you don't do what they want you to do while they're trying to control you, they're going to either try to kill you, 
they're going to try to have him thrown in jail on some sneaky bullshit charge, or they're going to try to have him put in a psych ward or some sort of group home to where he won't be able to do anything ever again. I should know because that's what they did to me. Because of these people, I ended up in jail and now I have to face a, a charge that is a misdemeanor charge that I'm, that I'm more than likely going to have to serve not many jail time, but I'm going to have to serve probation for. I don't know though. So I'm telling you right now, Daniel, these people are not your friends. If anybody's your friend, I'm, I'm probably the only friend, real friend that you've got right now. If anybody's your friend, I'm your friend. Because I've been through this shit, dude. I know what it's like. I've seen your channel, and some of your content actually is pretty interesting. I'm not gonna lie. Some of it is pretty interesting. But like I said, dude, do not trust these people. Alright? Do not trust these people at all. They do not be trusted. These people that are following you around, you need to go to the police. You need to say something, man. Because if you don't say something, things are going to get worse. They're going to make your life worse. Let me tell you something, Danny. Back before I was getting trolled, I was a music artist. I was always recording, always writing, always putting out music. I had just put out two albums back to back that people loved and were enjoying. And you know what happened? All that got ripped away in a matter of minutes. Just like that. One on one, because these people didn't mean what they're doing to you. You can't trust these people, Daniel. If anybody's your friend, I'm your friend. Because I have the connections to the people that help you out. And the people that I'm connected with, they want to help you. They want to help me, they want to help you, they want to help the victims of these evil people put a stop to this. So if you see this, Daniel, please comment on this video. Let me know that you're okay. Let me know that you're alive. Let me know that you're doing good. You know, just comment on this video, man. Because I want to try to reach out to you and help you. But I need your help to do that. And if you need my number, it's 234-817-2418. Again, that's 234-817-2418. You can reach me anytime, day or night. Or if you don't feel comfortable with that, you can do it with me, comment back and forth on each other's videos. That's okay. I'm okay with either one. But like I said, Daniel, these people ain't your friend. These people ain't your friends. They're evil. They're disgusting. They're vile. And as for you trolls going out to Daniel and myself and Foodie BB and all these other people, you guys need to fuck it off. For real, y'all need to screw off, man. Because let me tell you right now, I said it before in previous videos and I'll say it again. Myself, Sneaky Jim, and the Shadow Collective. Our tongue will shut you guys down one way or another. He will be shut down and he will be brought to justice for what you guys have done. And are doing. Because everything you guys are doing is highly illegal and it's not okay. It's going to be stopped. By myself, Sneaky Jim, 
and the shadow of blood. And to Daniel, I just hope that you're okay, and I hope that you're safe. Man. I hope and pray that you're safe and that you're okay. So, if you see this, Daniel, please make your video, make your comment, do something to look to your teachers. Find a way to give back to me, please. 